Hi, this is Kelly Berger from Bookkeeper Support, and this is how to do a bank feed in Myob Account Right. So we go to bank feeds. Make sure that we've allocated all the transactions in here. So new pay bill in this instance. Houston, Houston, we're going to pay 228. So we're just going to, this is just a demo file. So we're just going to match it up with any of them. Right, Mountain Springs, again, we'll match it up with whatever we can, being it's a demo file. No, we don't want to apply credits. We'll just add it on to there. So when you're reconciling, you want to go from here, once you've cleared it all out and go reconcile. You, in the online version, it will pick the date for you automatically as the today's date. You'll put in your closing balance. So we'll just say it's um, 16498.02, which generally those two should match anyway, if this is correct. So all of these lines should be colored in. If they're not colored in, then that means that uh, someone has put in a transaction that does not belong there or a whole heap of payments that have not actually come into the bank account. And that's something that you'll have to go and investigate. But ideally, this should all be colored in and you should have a zero out of balance sitting up here, right? Now that has to, that closing statement balance has to match your bank balance exactly, okay? And then you can reconcile, print report so that you've got the reconciliation uh, in PDF form or you've got it as a printed copy and then you reconcile and it's all gone. So ultimately that should be a clear list. There should be nothing in there and your bank balance should match that calculated statement balance. And if it doesn't, then you need to go find out why, which means manually going through the bank reconciliation. Okay, have a fantastic day. Enjoy.